<laughs> Hi guys, I don't know if you can see me. <laughs> Thank you for joining me today for today's art talk. My name is Dark Moon Doll. Uh, every Tuesday I try to bring to you uh, just how I create my artwork, why I create my artwork, and um, help to inspire you to become creative. <laughs> And today, let me sit down. <laughs> today I'm here in my art studio, and I'm doing a bit of organizing. If you can see me now. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I'm doing a little bit of organizing back here, and uh, I just sold a doll, a bottle doll, this one. Her name's Orinthia Darkman. Let's see. If you've seen any of my other shows, you'll know on Art Talk you'll know that I like to make dolls and all kinds of dolls and these are the dolls that I've been making a lot of is the bottle dolls the bottle dolls I basically what I use is most of the time a stone for the head glued onto a glass bottle then paper mache and then after I paper mache it I paint it with acrylic paints and after it's dried really well, the acrylic paints, then I give it a, maybe like three coatings of Mod Podge, which is a sealant that works really well to seal the, the paint in so it doesn't chip off of the surface. So yeah, I sold this one today, and I'm excited I'm going to mail this off today. And... Um, yeah, I hope you guys are finding ways to be creative. Um, I'm getting ready to, uh, well, not just right now. I've got some other errands to do today. But later on today, I'm going to work on a new doll. I'm going to show you guys. Hold on. <laughs> so, yeah, this one is, uh, it's a Muse doll. It's like, it's an angelic Muse doll that I've been working on. A friend of mine sent me a porcelain doll through the mail. She gets these porcelain dolls at the thrift store, and she'll ask me if I want her to pick pick me up one since she's there, and I say, yes, thank you. <laughs> so, thanks, Wendy. But anyway, um, yeah, this is the new project I'm working on. I plan on doing is gluing fabric on here for the wings. Uh, I have some really nice lace fabric. So, um, yeah, she's a musical muse. You can tell by what I paper mache her body with, which is uh, magazine ads from a guitar player, which was so graciously donated by my husband. And, uh, yeah, so all I want to do is finish the wings. I did the hair. Pretty much, like, braided it and twisted it. Her hair was kind of raggedy when I got it, so I figured I'd kind of spice it up. I'll put some beads in there and uh, that will probably be it. The face, I think I want to do a little more face painting with the face and tattoo uh, on the arms and then perhaps tattoo on the face too. So yeah, these ideas are coming to me as I look at her. <laughs> so yeah, that's what I'm working on right now. It's easy to do. If you guys want me to do a tutorial on it, I can, step by step. Um, I have another doll, too, that, that's in the works. So just let me know. And you know what? Uh, you notice how there's a support here on a lot of the vid videos now that I make? You can donate money for supplies to help me to, you know, do step-by-step uh, -step tutorials that you would like to see that you're interested in. Because the supplies uh, would help. I mean, most of the stuff I recycle, but the other supplies that I get and that I need is like, uh, like paint for the final, like, process of making these dolls. <laughs> Alrighty, guys. Well, thank you for joining me today uh, in my art studio. I'm um, going to mail this, that doll off uh, and get on out of here. Um, so, yeah, I hope you guys find some time in your day to be creative. Peace. Oh, also, thank you for subscribing. Thank you for liking. Thank you for sharing. Thank you for leaving kind comments. And thank you for, uh, yeah, just watching it. Just watching and being interested. Till next time, guys. Peace. Oops.